This is a Lego box. Some Lego boxes have these thumb tabs to open them, and other ones just have a couple strips of tape on the side. There also used to be these Lego boxes that had a flap that you could open to see all of the pieces inside, and there's even Lego sets that come in plastic boxes that look like Lego bricks. Also, more recently, there are these Lego minifigure accessory boxes, if you even want to call them boxes. And also, you remember those collectible minifigure foil packs that you used to be able to feel around to get a good idea of what minifigure you were getting? Well, LEGO just recently announced that from now on, they will be using a small cardboard boxes for CMFs instead of those foil packs. Bruh. So I guess that adds another type of Lego box to this list. Now I'm sure anyone with half a brain cell could figure out how to open one of these boxes, but today I'm gonna show you how to do it the correct way, or at least the way I do it. These normal boxes are pretty easy, or at least I would assume they would be pretty easy to open, but I'm a perfectionist when it comes to the condition of my Lego boxes even if they're open ones. I've seen people just peel off the tape or even just tear open the side of the box, Bruh. but the way that I open them is taking a knife and cutting the two pieces of tape on the left side of the box where all the set information is. This is just the way that I open these boxes. Don't ask me why it's the left side. That's just the way that I've always done it. This is also the same side that the thumb tabs are on for the thumb tab boxes, so it kind of just makes sense for me personally. and. You know, it always looks nice because they're all cut on the same side when I, you know, store these boxes away in my closet. Now for these thumb tab boxes. These boxes are the death of me. And, you know, these only used to be on smaller LEGO sets like battle packs and other things like that. But LEGO has progressively been implementing this thumb tab design into larger LEGO sets, which is just super annoying. I wish they would just do tape. But every time I've tried to open these boxes the way that they're designed to be opened, the box always ends up getting creased and... So I devised a new ingenious way to open these boxes, even though people are definitely already doing this. So all you need to do is take a brick separator or even just like an X-Acto knife, wedge it between the seal of the box and drag it across to open the box and bam, you got yourself a clean looking box at the end of it with no creases or anything. I know that a lot of people like me are super OCD about the condition of their boxes and how they open their boxes and want everything to be the same every single time. So figured I'd make this video. Hope you guys enjoyed and I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.